What's up guys, you're watching to us Apple, today I'm going to talk about WWDC 2013 iOS 7. Let's get started. First of all, iOS 7 has a, it's redesigned. The lock screen is even better. Um, you have an animated wallpaper on the on the background of your device, and the slide to unlock still slide to unlock, but it's even better. You have you still have the uh, camera shortcut for launching the camera, but it's redesigned. And also the animations uh, when you unlock the device or do do stuffs on the phone uh, are changed. Also, if you look the icons, everything has changed. Messages, calendar, photos, camera, all of these apps are already changed. They also changed Siri. Messages app, the notification center, which is even better. I mean, I mean that when you drop down the notification center, um, it goes foggy at the background, and you have the your all of your notifications and uh, pretty much all you all your notifications. You have a new feature when you swipe uh, from. Uh, from the from the drop down app you have a new feature called um, control center also you have a brand new multitasking uh, launcher to for you have also a, a preview on on all your applications um, you have iTunes Radio now. You have photos, new application for photos. You have AirDrop, which allows you to send uh, uh, very quick some photos and stuff like this on with uh, on other devices, which are running iOS 7. You have a brand new camera application, which is redesigned. You have you can swipe between modes, panorama, video, and uh, square. Yes. You have a redesigned Safari, you have brand new Siri with a new voice, a brand new mail app, a new weather widget, a new weather app, messages, and a feature which was on Android which you have to swipe and go back. iOS 7 also if you tick your iPhone like if you get your iPhone and then you can swipe it, uh, like when you move it around, you will get a um, 3D effect with your uh, on your iPhone on the background of your device. That's good. And iOS 7 will be available for your iPhone 4, iPhone 4S, and iPhone 5. The iPod Touch with a 16 gigabyte without the camera, and the iPod Touch fifth generation the 32 gigabyte and the 64 gigabyte model and with the iPads, the iPad 2, 3rd generation and 4th generation and also the iPad mini. Thanks for watching uh, the small preview of iOS 7. Uh, please subscribe to the channel for more videos for iOS and Mac, Apple devices, stuff like this and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.